Hi, George. So you've been talking about that cowboy coffee. Can you show us how to make it, please? Thank you. That is a good question, Agnieszka. Uh, so I thought I would make a video for you and the audience. Start with cold water. How much coffee do you want to make? I make two cups a day, so two large cups. They're about 12 ounce cups. I put them in a saucepan, filtered water. I don't use tap water. And I bring it to a boil. And then I add two scoops of my favorite coffee, heaping scoops, while it's boiling. Then I turn it down a little bit, but I want it to have a rolling boil. I mean, I really want it to be like this, just rolling over. And I do that for about four minutes. And then I pull it aside and then watch what I do next. I take cold water again, just a little bit, and I pour it in there, around there, around the rim. That makes the grounds sink to the bottom. Now watch when I pour it off now into my cup, which I have heavy cream in there. There's absolutely no grounds. You would think that there would be grounds, but the cold water added at the very end, and then you let it sit for a couple minutes, it makes those grounds go right to the bottom. And then I pour the rest in a thermal mug. And that's for my second cup of coffee later, or when I make bulletproof coffee. And then when it's all poured off, you can see the pan right here. And they're all at the bottom. It's fantastic. But first, cowboy coffee. Nice. Taste like coffee. I love my coffee to have a coffee flavor, not a coffee-like flavor. That rolling boil really brings the flavor out of the coffee. It's nice.